In this lesson, you'll learn how to activate upfront payments, link your Stripe account, and set up your upfront payment rules. First, log into the console and click on the Book Me Settings tile. If you have multiple sites, select a site. Then select Upfront Payment Settings. Read the terms and conditions and ensure that your details have been entered into the relevant fields. Then tick this box and press Accept to agree to the terms and conditions. First click on Edit General Settings. Then click here to connect to your Stripe account. If you don't have a Stripe account, you can create an account here by filling out your details. Or if you already have a Stripe account, click here to sign in. Once you've linked your Stripe account, click on Edit General Settings again. Tick this box to activate upfront payments. You'll notice that a default upfront payment policy has been added for you, which is the policy your clients will see when they make an upfront payment. Ensure that the policy adheres to any regional legislation in your area and make any changes necessary to reflect your business policies and procedures. Press Save to save your changes. The next step is to set up your upfront payment rules. The rules that you set up determine how much the client will be charged when they make an online booking. For example, you may wish to create a rule for a 20% deposit on all online bookings. You can also set up more specific rules depending on the services, employees and how close to the appointment the booking is made. To create a rule, select Add New Rule. The name of the rule should briefly describe what the rule does. If you only want to apply the rule to bookings made a specific number of days in advance, you can add the number of days here. However, if you want the rule to apply to all bookings, set this number to zero. You can request upfront payment for a percentage of the value of the booking, a set amount, or both. If you add both, the client will be charged whichever has the higher value of the two. Check this box to make the rule active for online booking and the mobile guest app. Press Save to save your changes. If you only want to apply the rule when certain employees are selected, click the Select Employees button and tick the relevant employees. If you don't select any employees, the rule will apply to all employees by default. Press Save to save your changes. If you only want to apply the rule to bookings for specific services, click the Select Services button. If you don't select any services, the rule will apply to all services by default. Tick the relevant services or service categories to make your selection. Then press Save. You can always make changes to a rule by selecting the Edit options. If you have more than one rule, select the priority for each of your rules. To move a rule up the priority list, click Move Up. If multiple rules apply to a certain booking, the rule with the highest priority will be applied. If you wish to copy these settings to another site, click Copy Settings. Choose the site you wish to copy settings from. Then select which applications you want to copy settings for. Tick this box if you also want to copy gallery images from the source site. Note that these will override any existing gallery images. Select the sites you wish to copy to. Then press Copy Settings. Now that you know how to set up upfront payments, you can start taking upfront payments through online booking and the mobile guest app. 